Criticate! Neat. I am a neat. Technically, I am a neat right now because my oh yeah, yeah my college has <laughs> started, so I don't Not have a job. So I'm a neat. Employment or training? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <gasps> oh, we're in the mysterious <gasps> east. Oh, okay, so this is new PlayStation. So let me just new make place. Sure. Ish. Okay, everything's good. Get get the controls down. Yeah, because yeah. that fucked me the last time. We're gonna try real hard to not lose an episode. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I just like, made double made sure that we were recording yeah, right yeah, now, and right I now. watched Jacob start this. Yeah, <laughs> but it's it's you know it gets confusing. Oh, the name of this episode is going to be Jake Paul dabs on the emoji movie. <laughs> so it's okay. not clickbait because I said it in the episode. <laughs> I guess. What are your opinions on Jake Paul? None. You don't. What? <laughs> what? Wait. So so you you need to like explain that shit. Uh, oh, you don't think our fans know who Jake Paul is? No, I don't know. You don't know who Jake Paul is. <laughs> I mean, I know who Jake Paul is, but I, I need okay. I don't know about him dabbing or whatever. I'm going to now do the full Jake Paul retrospective. Oh god. So in on Vine, yeah. there was a popular Vine star named Logan Paul. Mm-hmm. Uh, he's still popular on YouTube. Did you ever see that video of like colorblind guy sees for the first time? Yeah. yeah and yeah. it's that guy really overreacting? Yeah. That's that's Jake or that's that's uh yeah, yeah, Jake's I brother know. Logan. <laughs> yeah, I, I knew that. Okay, and if the audience didn't know. Oh, yeah, yeah, if you guy. don't know. So so what happened is uh, when Vine shut down, these two people flocked to YouTube. Sure. I'm pretty sure I have to go over there. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Uh those two they they both flocked to YouTube and started making daily vlogs. Right, right. And so, you know, the thriving daily vlog <laughs> it YouTube is. community. Yeah, I know it is. It really is. It's just I bugs me sometimes yeah me too but go ahead. I, I don't like their content no yeah I, sure 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 yeah yeah so so jake paul and logan paul were basically just kind of attention grabby whatever big vine stars only popular because they're hot and they know it uh <laughs> except logan paul's not hot jake is i will i will concede to saying that jake paul is very attractive <laughs> okay yeah uh sure. but um so all the while so so uh jake paul started his own he, he moved out to Los Angeles, uh, started working for Disney Channel, and he worked up to a million dollars. Okay, yeah. And he uh, bought his own company, and he, and he gained investors, and he did some entrepreneuring, and it, now he, he owns a company called Team 10. So, okay. So here, here's how things went down, because yesterday there was an episode... Oh, <coughs> Alice, no. <laughs> <laughs> there was an episode, or yesterday when this came out, uh, or, or when, I, when I'm recording... <laughs> Sorry, yes, that, was, <laughs> that was really funny. <laughs> Yesterday, with this, oh. when, when when this is being recorded, uh, there was an episode of the H three H three podcast. H three H three Productions is a very popular YouTube channel yes. that does reactions to YouTube videos and stuff. Yeah, yeah. And they're very funny, and I, I I like their content a lot. They're okay. I, I'm not a huge fan. Yeah, of yeah. Them. I mean, teach them. So yeah, yeah. Uh, I I like them. So. They had an episode yesterday, and they basically started this whole big uh, uh, Jake Paul fucking sucks train. Really? Yeah, it was pretty much all of them. Okay. So, um, and, and Jake knows that, mm-hmm. um, as evidenced by what I saw. So this is sure. uh, how th- events seem to go down okay. uh, from the outside. And now I, and then I'll go back and I'll explain all the events from Jake's perspective that I learned from, uh, from that podcast. Okay. So there was on... So so Team Ten, the uh, their house, their business address was just Jake's home, and it was just a residential home. Right. So their business address went on to Google. Okay. So a bunch of te- tween fans yeah. started flooding over, and and Jake Paul was also a star on Disney Channel on the show Bizarre Bark, which was really popular. Okay. Um, <laughs> I know, know nothing s- about that, but sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, he he was a Disney star. Yeah. yeah. Uh, but after he was a YouTuber, so yeah, he, yeah, yeah. So he was he was dominating on on a lot of fields. I mean, he's a, he's a millionaire. I mean, yeah, yeah, right, of course. And he worked up to it. And I, I'm not going to shit on fuck. No, and I'm not going to shit on that because he's he's a brilliant businessman and sure. entrepreneur. Uh, so, uh, at one point there was uh, a bit of a story leaking where, uh, okay, is that just not going? Oh, here, um, where his, no, that's not going to come down enough. Well, maybe it is. Uh, where his team ten. <laughs> Was causing issues for his neighbors. 
Oh, because uh, oh. their vlogs were shit like right. starting a car on fire, yeah. like breaking shit, yeah, yeah. And doing crazy Did shit. Hear about that? And then also, but the main issue was they were doing that all during the that's day, the, and that's not actually that bad. But that's how it, the, you're, you're the, going backwards. Oh, you're supposed I? to go up. Oh through. shit! Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> uh, and that's how the 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 vlogs and shit. It all made it seem like that was the issue. Right. Right. Uh, but tr- truly, the issue was the fans coming. Yeah, of and course. so that 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 all seems shitty of, of Jake. So it, when he was on on the camera for his his uh, interview with the with the news, okay, uh, he kind of just did a bunch of crazy, stupid shit. Uh huh. Like you know, Vine Star shit. Yeah, I guess. Like he climbed up on the car and he like and he was like partying and he's just yeah. like he's like yeah, whatever. Those neighbors are just haters. Dab. Uh, <laughs> and shit like that. Ah. Uh, and. Dumb. Uh, yeah, I know, really dumb. And then so so you know, Ethan on H3H3 yeah. posted a bunch of videos reacting to that and the news story blew up. <laughs> uh, and now it's like anytime you put Jake Paul in your title, I mean shit, like it goes big. Yeah. Oh, one of these again. Yeah. And so more 2D. Yeah, 2D. <laughs> 2D. 2D fruity. Uh uh, funny. So <laughs> <laughs> we're not funny on this channel, Robert. Yeah, we, we're just a Jake Paul <laughs> retrospective. Yeah, channel. exactly. So, uh, so, uh, famous rapper Post Malone goes on the H three H three podcast, and they talk some smack on, on Jake Paul. Sure. And then, uh, just a meme on him. Yeah. Uh, Post Malone buys some of Jake Paul's merch. <laughs> oh no! It all started because Jake released a shitty rap song. Oh, okay. Yeah, I call this every day, bro. Uh, and that that song is really bad and funny, yeah. and the lyrics are really shitty. Like one of the famous memes that came out of it was there's this one guy who sings on the tr- or raps on the track, and he's he's uh he's from London. Yeah. Uh, and one of one of the lines that he raps is, uh, "I'm not from New York. No, I'm not from Compton. England is my city." <laughs> 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 and it's really stupid. Oh god, and, I love that shit. And then he he talks about his merch is selling like a god church was another line. <laughs> <laughs> so, so post is, Malone, is it like ironic or is? Oh uh, like, no, it was unironic. They wrote it in three hours. That's oh, that was the explanation. Okay, okay. It was a joke, but it didn't seem okay. like it because it was really professional. Sure, done. sure, sure. Uh, so, so uh, post Malone bought a selling like a God Church T-shirt, <laughs> and then um, Luke or, or, or Jake came to his house. Okay. Uh, like on vlog. Oh. He did ask him if oh. it was cool to record. Okay. But clearly, Jake misunderstood that post meant it's cool to um. Uh, record from this point onward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he took shots of outside of his house, uh, and that is potentially very dangerous yeah. for celebrities. Yeah, of course. Uh, luckily, uh, he was fine. No one, no one located his house. God damn, uh, though. And so that was just irresponsible. You know, and I could see that as an honest mistake. But then, you know, the I internet guess. flipped a collective shit. But that's it's a, a bad that's idea. That's a dangerous that's honest a mistake. That's a dangerous honest mistake. Yeah. Yeah. And, but, but Post, to be fair, never asked him to take the video down. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And so, uh, and that, that's something that Jake said on the podcast. So yeah. that's all the shit that went down with him. Okay. And, and so everyone hates on him for just being a rowdy dickhole. Yeah. So then he goes on the podcast yesterday and he explains his thing. Oh, uh, by the way, rowdy dickhole band name, I called it. <laughs> So go ahead. <laughs> okay, I need to finish this up. Yeah. We're getting to the end. We're getting this close. This is just an exclusively <laughs> Jake sure. Paul retrospective episode. Um, I remember Jake, Jake Paul dabs on the Emoji Movie is the title. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, so quickly get to why Jake Paul dabs in the mo- in the Emoji. Oh movie. no, no, that's just. <laughs> oh come on, man. <laughs> yeah, no, because because okay. this whole thing is he dabs on the haters. That's the thing that he said during the interview. Oh okay. Yeah. And then that's it. Yeah. So, um. So, uh, so on the podcast yesterday, he came on and he explained his case. Sure. So, uh, as it appeared, uh, he gets basically no sleep. He he makes it seem like he has this big group of people that works for him. Yeah. He edits all of his daily vlogs, and his daily vlogs are like twenty minutes long. Sure, sure. And so he, when he was working at Disney, yeah, uh, for for Bizarre Bar, <sighs> that turns <laughs> off. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. When he's working for at Bizarre Bar, he was there nine to five yeah. shooting vlogs and then all night he's sure. editing. Yeah. yeah so yeah. he I had an incredible that. grind and he made his million very legitimately. Yeah. Yeah. And he's very smart. He's an incredible businessman. Sure. And, and he's a lot of driving goals. And I, I actually respect the hell out of that. Okay. And so when that, when that news report came on, uh, they actually also on the H3 podcast brought the guy who broke the story mm. to Casey, K, KT LA or whatever it's called. KT Casey, LMNOP. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he the 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 journalist that broke that broke the story and was the reporter for it. Mm-hmm. Uh, and so they explained the case. It, they were basically 
uh, unspoken working together to try and create the most popular news story for yeah. both of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, and and it did work because because it was it was a very successful tra uh, um, crossover between modern and. Uh, traditional media. Sure, sure. Because uh, it brought attention to the news and it brought attention to new media. So right. it was a very successful merger and, and, and uh, you know, doing shit like climbing on the truck and, and acting all silly and rowdy and spouting catchphrases. You know, that was all an act. You know, Jake wasn't actually being a dick to his neighbors. Sure. Like he, he, he try, he's trying to solve the issue. He did not put his address on Google. Uh, someone doxed him. Oh, okay. And then they put his address on Google, and he can't get it removed. Mm. And he's been trying. And he's also been trying to <sighs> move. But ever since the news report, he can't, he can't get a job move. because the news report blew up way more than yeah, they all expected. Yeah, yeah. So he can't get a new place, <clears throat> even going through an alias. Huh. And so so he's stuck. And so he's trying his best to, to do to work well with the neighbors. And he's, okay, and he's trying okay. his best. And he's, he doesn't actually come across as that bad of a guy. The only really big mistake I think he's ever made legitimately that is worthy of, of him being, like, shit on yeah. is probably the Post Malone thing. And uh, that is an honest mistake, a dangerous honest mistake. I guess. But but he's, he's getting bad press. And when, when you do shit, like, pretend that you're bugging your neighbors by jumping on cars and shit, it, it's hard to not... It's hard not to take that at face value. Exactly. Like, like if you're and, just like a person. And th th the thing with him is, is he knows that people hate on him. Yeah, yeah. And he's fine with it. I, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. He, he's he understands his position as right. like a meme, and and, and and so he's cool. I mean, uh, he, I, I honestly respect him a lot as a, as as a businessman. Okay. Yeah, I, I think he's very respectable in what he does, uh, and and you know. He, he, he's done some shitty things. I mean, he, he's a douchebag. Yeah. <laughs> That's not... But he's very smart, and he, and he has a lot of drive for what he does, and he's okay. He's popular for a reason, and, and I'm not going to try and take that from him. And, and it's very... It's a bit dangerous mindset to go along with the crowd and just uh, overarching say, what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Okay, I thought you could land on whatever. <laughs> uh, it's not clear. Yeah. Um, it's a very dangerous mindset to just go with the crowd and say... Jake Paul is a douche and deserves to die or whatever. Oh yeah, no one fucking deserves to die. I just yeah. you, you know what? If he's a douche and if 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 his image is that he's a douche, uh, fine. Like like Kim Kardashian owns the fact that she has a sex tape. Fine. Yeah. I don't have to respect you for it. I I, I don't really respect that. Mm -hmm. Other people might. Other people might like you. Well, well. I mean, a lot of the times he isn't just doing douchey stuff. I mean, he's doing his YouTube thing, and and, and every once yeah, in a while. Yeah, but there are plenty of YouTubers with, who with do it. Daily vlogs and daily things. You know, there's going to be moments where you come across as as kind of a douche. As but, kind of a douche. I mean, like uh, Shay, who who made vlogumentary. He, he's yeah. not a douche almost ever. The the only douchey thing is that he he started in like. Uh, 2000 and like four whatever a long time ago uh on, and and his yeah this part's bullshit this part sucks ass uh and his fans are called shades from a long time oh, ago no. and that has not aged well for obvious reasons uh yeah uh kind of bleak the last part of that no uh, yeah if you don't know look it up uh, yeah it, it, it's it's a slur or whatever it's a slur it, it's it, it has it, it was more okay I mean it wasn't okay yeah but like it was more accepted when when he started exactly that. yeah so uh, you know what it's not mm -hmm. but but he's a genuinely nice guy he doesn't do anything wrong he asks for permission or everything yeah and, and that's the way and, to do and, it um and Jake Paul does all that but yeah he just does I'm it sure. off camera yeah yeah he, he's his, a very his image different on being, camera persona sure uh and yeah, I'm so not that's, a fan of that. That's my retrospective yeah. on Jake Paul. Uh, <laughs> so we're we're gonna get through this bullshit part next uh, on the next episode. Yeah, this, this is dumb. This shit. is super bullshit. And we'll actually talk we'll, about we'll things talk next about time. how bullshit this is. Yeah, we, we, yeah. Instead of talking about <laughs> Jake, Jake Paul reviews, <laughs> uh, subscribe. <laughs>